Hi guys, it's James here from Optics Warehouse, your night vision and hunting specialist. And yes, I am lying down in a field. Uh, why am I lying down in a field, you may ask? Well, the simple uh, simple answer to that is I just um, oh, I just want to show you guys exactly how um, how exactly pixelation does affect digital day-night scopes at distance. So um, there is a camera lens behind me. Um, and I don't know if you'll be able to see, you should be able to see it properly. Um, but we are looking at a set of bales uh, across a valley they are approximately 550 yards away as the crow flies um, and i must 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 make this clear there is no rounds no bolt nothing no shots going to be taken through this rifle here as you can see it's all all crystal clear just for all intensive purposes it's just there just to show you exactly how it would set up so this is this is on one of my um one of my 243s so obviously so this is a rifle that's currently in use quite a lot but as i say just for today um there is nothing going on with this rifle apart from just the scope being on top now, obviously, if we look at um, look at a parallax error, obviously, obviously, different distances for various day scopes, etc., all that sort of thing. We all know how important it is that when the further you get out, how finite the adjustment is, so you can get that nice crisp, crisp um, picture, and therefore not end up with a bit of haze on the target itself, and therefore become inaccurate. With digital stuff, uh, that has changed once further. Obviously, it just it's it's gone up and up and up. So when you started looking at digital stuff, maybe five six years ago. It was a bit hard to focus the stuff at distance, but what I'm going to show you here today is how good, say something like the Wolf 4K actually is, uh, when you mag it right up and it's on the um, and it's at distance as well. Just to show you this, I mean, the, the Wolf 4K represents the best in pixelation, anti-pixelation distortion. Uh, I mean, I, may, I might have made that phrase up by myself, but what it is, it just shows you how good this thing is on high mag and at long range compared to other other day night scopes. Now, yes, of course, this is during the daytime uh, where a lot of people will purchase this weapon scope just to be used at nighttime. So, of course, I will try and do the equivalent at nighttime if possible for you guys as well, just to show you how well it works. Just bear in mind, at nighttime, it's slightly different because you are really, uh, you are relying on a third party item. So, you're not going to be using the IR that comes with it because that's just simply not powerful enough. And that's the same across all day night scopes, the IRs that come with them. They're just not strong enough, unfortunately. So you have to uh, have to use a uh, third party, a different, a different company IR torch, and obviously there's various ones out there that we all know about, um, laser-based ones that are going to do the job, uh, especially out to 600 yards. But say so I'll, I'll do my very best to get some footage out for you on that one. But just to show you today, I'm just going to sit behind the rifle now, and I'm just going to get it all set up. And as you can see, I've got it there now. There you go. So crosshairs are on the bales there. Um, and I so say we're looking at 550 yards and this is the base mag of three times what I'll do is I'll just make sure they're in focus so you can see it going out focus that way out focus that way so there we go we'll go for that bottom right bell as if we imagine that was the target and all we do is you know with the wolf 4k simply just dial it in nice and easy I've not changed anything so far um, absolutely going right in crystal clear Crystal, crystal, there we go. And you just like see a slight bit of pixelation, but there you go now. So I will just alter, you see he's altering the focus either way, just to show you, there you go. So those bales there, guys, they're 550 yards away. If there was a crow on there right now, I'd be quite comfortable in shooting it. Obviously with the correct amount of um, of uh, holdover, etc., and obviously taking into account various wind and ballistics, etc but I quite confidently identify a crow at that sort of distance. And that really is testament to the Wolf 4K, Sony 4K sensor inside. Um, it's a sensor that you don't see in any other, any other day scope at the moment. Um, so it really does true testament to this unit, um, especially for a 30 mm tube unit. Yes, it may have a slightly smaller screen inside and therefore less lesser field of view compared to other day night scopes. But as I say, that Sony 4K sensor really resoluting a high quality image. So you can see through there, there you go. I mean, there's a small, what looks like a solar panel for the electric fence. I didn't even know was there from this distance. I mean, if I wind it all the way back, oh, as I bring it all the way back, there you go. I couldn't, even, I couldn't identify that. There you go. Didn't even know it was there. But then again, I zoom in, zoom right in. There you go. There you go. I could count the amount of bales that are on there. And I say, if there was a crow or if there's a rabbit up there, or something that I fancy taking a pop at long range, maybe if I had a more long range shooter calibre, say like a 6.5 Creedmoor or something like that, then yes, I'd be quite confident taking that shot. And I can tell you now, it's reciprocated at night when you have a laser-based IR, I can tell you that first hand from, from what I've used, etc. Um, 
so with this scope here value for money wise is if you can't afford a c50 or you can't get a hold of one which is more than likely the case this is your next best option i mean i quite quite confidently say that um based on all the attributes that come with it um the actual quality of the sensor and whatnot it is um it is going to be your best option so guys so you've seen obviously from there how this operates during the daytime i've looked to get some nighttime footage out for you as well um nice crisp focus minimal pixelation which is what you do get with a lot of other day night scopes um overall just a high quality piece of kit um as i say they've got um a lot of features on here as well really make it a um a nice um nice bit of kit to use out in the field nice and easy to use as well if you want to put on various different rifles etc hope you've enjoyed the video i uh, hope you learned a bit more about the wolf 4k and obviously a bit more about pixelation as well i've been james your night vision and hunting specialist and this has been another video by optics warehouse <laughs>